<laughs> tell me again how this works. You got to breathe like you're shooting a gun, okay? And you got to be one with the weld, and you got to get the hula skirt going up. Okay? That's how you do it. YouTube Minnesota Eric here so today I'm gonna to start uh, grinding out the crack uh, and as I can tell this giant blob of metal has been added on as weld and uh, it sure didn't grab very well and so I'm gonna to try to grind that out drill a hole somewhere around here to stop this crack from from uh, cracking further and uh, at some point, I'm going to come in here and try to put this edge of the blade uh, on cribbing and force all this together, come in here and uh, tack weld it, and then go at it with 7018 rods to to collect it up. But here I got to grind, do a fair amount of grinding. I'm going to be using the... Bring the water out. Bring the welder out, I heard. Yeah. That's a, that's a different noise. Right. Yeah, we need to we need to secure this. Keep that in that position. I wish that block wasn't right there, but I think we're just gonna have to figure it out. The water in the inside. Some of that thinner rod you got. I'm gonna go drink. <laughs> Stop it. Oh yeah, look at it. There you go. Come on. Okay, that's it. Right there, that's all we should need. You just did a 6010 rod on one ten with a miller. Yeah, no, it was okay. What do you got, 135? Turn that down to 110. You want 110? Yeah. I'll let you know if it's different. Well, it, won't, it won't let me go down past. Really, 115, that's fine. You got a chipper? So I gotta look at my welds, man. It's it's a thing, man. The, the water always has to check his welds out. This is the Either he's a good water or he's a bad water, and he, he owns multiple grinders. What the heck is this? It's your. Jeez. We're not wire feeding. No, here, hang on, hang on, hang on. There you go. Hey, did you, you see the gadget store? I love store? these things. Oh, you like that? I went, yeah, I, went, I was because, wondering if that's a bit too much of a gadget. No, but, here's uh, the deal. A lot of welders use just regular chippers. But they don't have the brush. Now, if you're welding with paint, I know that's a chipper. You know, it's not too bad. I'm getting with your fam, getting there in between my little tacks. This with good. the pointy I, end I think stick. I stopped in the right place. I like it. You know, I, uh, oh, you're, if anything, you're even undercutting that yeah, a little I bit. Yeah, I could have gone a little bit. Yeah, no, that's not that's bad. That's a good weld. No, thank you. Gee whiz. 
Mark, if it won't close, let's just weld up the gap. Well, I know, but it's too much. You still got a half inch gap. Well, it's a lot. I bought 10 pounds of welding rod. No, you won't get decent right. penetration. No. It's not, it's not. And I know I already have 10 pounds. We'll, we'll get it, we'll get it. Give me a little bit. I'm going to slice this sucker. It won't close. No steel will beat me. I like your attitude. There you go. Now we're past that. Wow. If this thing don't go down, I'll be amazed. Now we can weld that sucker. You got it? Yeah. But, but I mean, it's not tight, but it's a better and a half inch. Yeah, yeah I see what you had up. to do there to dig cut it. Yeah, I, I had to cut it farther. I just yeah. see I went past the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I think that's... Uh, boy, I don't think we could ask for a better result. No, I think it's fine. Yeah. I Your just hear this thing kick up. Fair. So it's recording. It's, it's all about YouTube. <laughs> smokes that looks pretty good Let's see how I dug in it. Yeah, yeah, see how yeah. Okay. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take and do another pass. So we need to put it really good. Slag is our enemy, man. Right, bring this bucket up. Let's get it off that block. Good, this, are you sure? Wimpy. Oh, it wasn't it wimpy when I first bought it. No, but look at the difference in the brushes. Yeah. It's well, that one says Hobart on the side, I believe. These are good brushes. I'm just telling you, I love these things. A lot of, a lot of iron workers hate these things, man. You know what this one says? I'm not making this up. It says orange. I don't want you to look at that at all. In fact, I want to have you go back inside. I don't want to flash the dog. Come on. Come on, buddy. Buddy. Yeah, that's a good boy. In you go. I'll say one thing, 
Mark, your skill is apparent when it comes to this iron work and stuff. Especially with, uh, especially with lining up the crack. <laughs> Tell me again how this works. You gotta breathe like you're shooting a gun, okay? And you gotta be one with well, and you gotta get the booster <laughs> Okay? That's how you do it. Serious God, I tell my guys to get that who's for fun. Because that's how well works. He's just trying to say do circle ease. <laughs> <laughs>